Hello guys, in this video I will try just um, to emphasize what I have said two weeks or three weeks ago about uh, Twitter. Now Twitter is really in a big problems and big trouble. Now I have made video before comparing it to Facebook and I told you see this, this big candlestick which is red there is a big sell off i have explained before it what does it mean here it doesn't mean that you should you should know who has sold off or whatever it's not important what is important is the price action and this what my strategy is always working on price action now this sell off the stock in the morning in April 28th 2015 it opens with $52.16 but at the end of the day it goes to $42.27 it means it lost $10 in one day $10 from from 52 to 42 and if if you have never put a stop loss here and you and you are uh, trading or investing in Twitter you will have a big loss that you will never you will never get it back okay so for me I was in this trade okay I, I bought it somewhere here but I put my stop loss and I got small loss uh, here I will not say as other people say uh, I was lucky no this is not luck you should calculate your stop loss you should calculate uh, your risk before you do any trade okay uh, to lose little money is part of the game of trading but to lose ten dollars in each share you bought this is a big problem and those who don't believe in stop loss they will get hit and they will lose by the end of the year now as I told you before see here the support line was on um, December 9th 2014 it means last year in December this is the support line where the stock stops and then it goes into a um, into a trend okay you see that it goes to a trend but unfortunately the trend stops okay and then there is trending into a range but today what did happen today today there is a gap down so there are there is another big sell off here so Twitter for me is in real trouble and as I told you before I don't like to buy from the from the support line this is another major problem now it goes down to 31.24 now I will tell you something if Twitter goes to the support line the last support line which is here which is $29.51 if it goes to this low which is uh, which is support line $29.51 this happens in May uh, 7th 2014 it means last year in May this is the bottom line if it goes these days below this I understand that Twitter will have a big sell-off and all major maybe major um, um, <coughs> major uh, mutual fans or those who hold they will drop and they will sell so it will be a very large problem so we don't know in the future what will happen but but uh, looking at the other chart uh, I am very p pessimistic right now and three weeks ago uh, when I made my video when there is a big sell off here so I was uh, very pessimistic and I don't buy losers okay so for those who hold still hold it uh, try to check if you get uh, um, a problem and what did I tell you last time I tell you 
that Facebook is different. Okay, see Facebook when I make the difference now. Facebook, okay, it is in a, a small trend now. Today is the earnings, we are not sure what will happen, but for me, I like the 100. If there is a gap up, this is the 100. Okay, I like the idea of 100 if um, if Facebook gets to 100 which is here now it's 96 it gets more believe me uh, there will be a big move a big trend because any stock that is 100 and continues to go up it, it should have a big trend and there is a confidence of the investors but right now uh, i didn't i didn't check the news and i don't like to check the news tomorrow in the morning i will check and uh if if things are good i will make another video okay so thank you very much for watching uh this uh, video uh i don't want uh, i see apple also i think apple also but i don't know what will happen um it's trending into a range you see that Okay, this is trending into a range. Uh, this is the resistance line. So a lot of people are having their eyes on this uh, resistance line and the support and support line. If uh, Apple goes down this um, uh, support line, there will be a problem for Apple also. Okay, but if it goes up and it hits the resistance line, it means that Apple will go up and up and up, and all the investors will make money. Thank you very much and have a nice day.